was a dominant, another dominating playoff performance, AJ. I think we just came out and just went to work. I think I think it was it was gonna be the, the most physical team that's gonna win and tonight we, we did that. What's it like to join a team in a year and go to a Super Bowl for you, my friend? Hey, it's crazy. I don't, I don't even know what to say, man. I'm so blessed, man. I, I'm so I'm so blessed how he pulled the trigger. Hey. I don't know what to say. I just want to celebrate my teammate. Step back and watch the step cook. You own 17 birds. Big ring, I play for the 17 birds. In my line, if you own 17 birds. Big ring, I play for the 17 birds. I know a guy if you own 17 birds. Big ring, I play for the 17 birds. I know a guy if you want 17 birds. Big ring, I play for the 17 birds. Yeah, I'm from the 17th curb. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lil Brunson back at you with the back at you, and I'm the best reporting on the Eagles. Before we get into the meat and potatoes, let me let y'all know real quick, man. Listen, the Super Bowl edition hurt season hats with the gold stitch are flying off the shelves. You know what I mean? Shout out to y'all for continuing to support our QB1 all the way up until the Super Bowl. You hear me? The Eagles are in the Super Bowl. I don't think y'all understand the magnitude of the sentence that I just said, man. But grab your gold stitch hurt season hat while supplies last. Only 360 of these are being made for each completion that Jalen Hurts has thrown during the regular season. And um, the ops have been revealed. The, the link to the description for that. The link for the hats will be in the description. You know what I mean? And we know who it is, man. We know who. who they done pulled off the Scooby-Doo mask. The monster pulled off the mask and it's the Kansas City Chiefs. But we're going to show them what a real monster is in two weeks. And the Super Bowl in Arizona is going down the Philadelphia Eagles versus the Kansas City Chiefs. In Arizona, you know what I mean? The Super Bowl is set. Those are the two teams. Andy Reid, who's coached 14 years in Philadelphia, 10 years at the Chiefs. People are calling this the Andy Reid Bowl. People are calling this the Kelsey Bowl. You know what I mean? Patrick Mahomes is the best quarter, the best young generational talent at the at the quarterback position. Jalen Hurts is a guy that's taken leaps and leaps and leaps and has brought his team all the way out of the comp, all the way out of the National Football Conference to meet head to head with these Titans who have been to the AFC Championship game. What is this, the last five years? The Chiefs, the Chiefs have been good for a long time. You know what I mean? And this is going to be a real test. Last time we saw the Kansas City Chiefs, you know what I mean? We got two weeks to talk about film and, and things that they've done this year and how different they look without Tyreek Hill and how we could possibly capitalize on that. But last time we saw them, Jonathan Gannon gave them a lot of respect. You know what I mean? And on the flip side of that, we didn't even punt against the Chiefs. We didn't have nearly the amount of weapons that we had last year. There are there are a few weapons short, but they are playing with a Chris Jones who was at a defensive player of the year level. We got one of those guys too in Hassan Reddick. Um, Patrick Mahomes is Patrick Mahomes. You know, you know, you can't say enough about that. But can the Philadelphia Eagles win this game? Absolutely. We open as one and a half point underdogs in this game. That's cool. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not mad at that. We didn't even really have to show our full bag, our full display in this game, simply because our offensive line was able to make easy work out of our last two opponents. You know what I mean? In the postseason, Jalen Hurst got two playoff wins. The offensive line just, the offensive line, and defensive line just took over the game. You know what I mean? And you know. I don't expect us to steamroll the Kansas City Chiefs this way. Andy Reid is a mastermind at the head coach position. But I expect us to win the Super Bowl in Arizona. Very, very doable. We got the defense that can mix things up and stifle these guys. But this is going to be a hell of a challenge for the Philadelphia Eagles, man. Uh, listen, you saw how tough it was at times in the NFC Championship game. You're going against the best. The best, the best. You know what I mean? From here on out, from, from championship on up, you're only going against teams that deserve to be there. We deserve to be there, which is why we punched our ticket to the Super Bowl. I can't talk for nobody else. You know what I mean? This is Patrick Mahomes. This is the Chiefs. This is Chiefs Nation. This is Chiefs Kingdom. This is all of that. You know what I'm saying? This is all of that. You know what I mean? This is what you ask for when you want to be in this position. We was here five years ago. We won the bowl. But this, we know what it takes. We got the dogs on the roster. The Chiefs got the dogs on the roster. They got the coaches. You know what I'm saying? We got the GM who's been here before. 
This is the big leagues now, man. All the mother guys we argue with and bicker with within the division, they don't understand the magnitude of what's going on right now the last couple of weeks of football. They don't know what it feels like, man. A lot of these guys in the division, they can't make a tape and say, Such, we in the Super Bowl. This my second one. This my second one. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these guys don't know what it takes to be doubted from the beginning all the way to the end. The Dallas Cowboys, they hope we lost. You see what I'm saying? Do you know what I'm saying? They beg to win next week just to pray that somebody else lost. All you had to do was finish your food. You could have met us at the altar. We wanted, we, we, we would have preferred had been y'all for real, for real. But y'all ain't had the cojones to meet us there. We got to go outside of the conference to go see what's good with everybody. Everybody who claimed to be bullies, they ain't make it out. We made it out. We got two weeks of being proud of that, but the coaches got one day of partying and they got to get back to the drawing board because Patrick Mahomes is out there and out there for the taking. Let me know what you think in the comments, man.